Another day of tense testimony in the Joe Carroyo trial as one of the plaintiffs suing the commissioner for millions was cross-examined by his attorney. Local 10's Ian Margul is live with what the jury heard. Ian. This trial has been going on for so long at this point that they actually lost a juror. They had to go home. It was interfering with their life too much. So now they are down to just two alternate jurors. Today, Fuller back on the stand and Carroyo's defense attorneys were cross-examining him once again. The federal civil trial for Joe Carroyo continues. The city of Miami commissioner is being sued by entrepreneurs Bill Fuller and Martin Pena for allegedly abusing his power to harass them and hurt their businesses, all because they supported his political opponent in 2017. During testimony on Wednesday, Fuller talked about this meeting from Valentine's Day 2019. He told jurors he watched on a live stream as Carroyo made a presentation that he and many others believed directly targeted Fuller's properties. They've been subjected to two hours of lies. Angry, Fuller rushed to City Hall to confront the commissioner, and the exchange that followed was recorded in the commission meeting archives. And you are the biggest fraud that's hit Miami. Sir, you are a fraud that beats his wife. On Thursday, Carroyo's attorneys got a chance to cross-examine Fuller, and things got testy quickly. At one point, the judge had to remind Fuller to answer the questions he was being asked and warn Carroyo's attorney, Ben Cuny, to not ask questions that were argumentative. Cuny spent most of the day showing jurors evidence that Fuller's properties had issues with code violations long before Carroyo was elected to District 3. And while Fuller acknowledged some of the issues, he maintained things became exponentially worse once Carroyo took office. And the other argument that Fuller's attorneys have been making throughout this entire trial is whether or not there were violations. Carroyo, they say, was so obsessed, so fixated on Fuller's properties, and that just wasn't his job. It bordered on harassment, and that's, the, that's why they say they are filing this lawsuit. They're going through this entire trial. Testimony will continue again tomorrow morning. Of course, we'll keep you posted every step of the way. Live in Fort Lauderdale, me and Margo, Local 10 News.